Okay, now we're going to play with some false eyelashes. These are red cherries. Excuse me. They are 102s. I got them off of eBay about a year ago. I bought them in bulk. And they're super fuzzy, super dense. And I thought they would lend themselves to this look. So I have some duo glue on there, the dark, so that it, when it's, it dries, it disappears. Okay, I'm going to add a little color to my cheeks now. I already had bronzer down to create some contouring. And I'm going to take a color called Plum Foolery. Kind of a plummy, peachy color. And I'm just going to put this on the apples of my cheeks. And smile. Okay, now I'm going to take a lighter pink color to highlight. And this is a Physician's Formula blush. And you'll see it's like a mosaic with a few different color of pinks and then a light highlight. And I'm using my 188 brush. That's the stippling brush from MAC, the Duo Fiber. And I like it because it's smaller for my smaller size cheek on my face. And so I'm just going to lay that over the... And this is another Physicians Formula color that I got. It's a virtual face powder, multi-reflective. It's kind of pretty. It's got a sheen to it. And same 188 brush. And this I'm going to use as a highlight. And I'm going to bring it right down my nose, in the middle, and then right along the highest part of my cheekbone, underneath my eyes. And I know that's a lot of highlight, but as a stage performer, you want a lot of reflective quality to your face. Okay, for my lips, I'm not going to go bold, though I probably could for a Vegas look. I think with big eyes and all the color that I'm going to be wearing, a pink lip with some glitter might be enough. So I had already put balm on my lips and lined them with a nude. And this is a rose-colored liner, like a pink, a Maybelline. And I'm just going to go back over my lips and line with this okay. pink. And I've chosen to go with a lighter pink. This is called Born With It. It is a Maybelline color lip brush and just dab to fill in where I lined. Okay, so now this is where I'm going to experiment and I'm going to take that same sealer that I used for the glitter on my eyes and the same glitter and I'm going to lay that pinky pink glitter and hologram glitter right over on my lips. Okay, now that I have that glitter on, I have to be careful not to mush my lips together because the lipstick will mix with the glitter if you moil your lips together and it'll kind of dull the sheen and the shimmer and the glitter. So now I'm going to cover with a gloss and this is Dazzle Glass Max Shazam. It's a silver with a reflex in it and I'm just going to take my lip brush and grab a little bit of that and then I'm going to dab it over. Okay, and the last thing I'm going to do is line my waterline. I always wait till last because I wear contacts and I don't want to, to fade off or get in my eyes and really irritate them. And again, I'm using Urban Decay's 24-7 pencil. It really stays And on. presto changeo, I am now a Vegas showgirl. Uh, you'll see I actually do create a huge headpiece for this. I'm going to duck down so you can see it. It's actually a visor that I bought at Hobby Lobby, 99 cents, and I'm wearing it the reverse way up on my forehead, and that is the foundation for all of this stuff. I love leftover Christmas. That's what that is, leftover Christmas sequins applied with a hot glue gun, and then leftover Christmas findings, and then an old purple boa for the feather part of the headdress. Pretty cool, huh? <laughs> okay, let me move in so you can see a little bit better of the look. So just a giant eye, defined brow, filled, uh, cut crease with purple and black and then pink on the lid with a pink and silver hologram glitter and then a silver liner underneath. Uh, lined on top and the bottom waterline, and then a big pair of false eyelashes. Glitter on that inner third of the eye to pop the eye open. A shimmery pink and bronze face to reflect light. And then on the lips, a nude pink color with hologram glitter and then a gloss over that. Threw in a pair of big sparkly earrings and a giant black feather boa, and I am ready. And you know what they say, what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. So I hope you enjoyed the tutorial. As always, it's always a lot of fun to do this stuff for you guys. Uh, and I shall see you real soon. Bye.